Yesterday, we talked about critical thinking. So if you want to know something about critical thinking, you can check out that video. But in this one, we're going to be talking about a subject where it requires us to actually be in an environment that we can live in regardless of whatever change happens in said environment, right? All right, I'm Josh V. Castro, you beautiful person. You, I'm pretty sure, you know, if no one told you you're pretty, handsome, good looking, then, you know, today's the day that someone did. And hopefully that wasn't just me. <laughs> All right. So in this hashtag project nine minute video, we're going to be talking about adapting, adaptation, or just adapt the word adapt. You know, human beings, we adapt really well. I just thought of that because, you know, in yesterday's video, I was on the roof and now I'm back in the studio. And what caused that adapting or what caused that change was the initiative that us humans can adapt. So, yeah, this is the, you know, this is part of the 30 day challenge for the, you know, Hashtag Project 9 minute video that I started. And we are probably on day 15. I'm not sure. All right, don't quote me on that. All right, so adapting. Humans have really the, what is it called? We, we're interesting. All right, no, just, you know, every, every animal, every being in this planet, you know, the, just the fact that we are engineered, we are evolved to adapt to circumstances, to situations, to environment to change that's just an amazing feat without that feat alone i'm like species in general would probably not have existed uh, i'm like you know take into account weather changes right you know if it's cold we wear we wear a jacket if it's hot we take off our shirt so that's how we adapt because you know you know you're going to a summer beach festival wearing your winter attire and like that doesn't sound right unless you're just afraid you'll get sunburned but you're gonna be sweating like yeah and then sweat that's one form of adapting you know your body knows that it has to adjust to environment changes and you know it then it produces this wet substance that coats our skin which keeps us insulated i don't know if that's the right term but it keeps us from you know, overheating, you know, as with computers, that's probably where that concept came from. I'm not sure. But yeah, it's amazing, you know, especially when it comes to high tolerance stress situations. You know, if you're in a job that requires, you know, lots of probably say willpower. I made a video on willpower, but th this job requires lots of willpower. And at the same time, there's lots of complex uh, stuff going on. And, you know, plus peer pressure from your boss, maybe, or, you know, from yourself because you want to provide, you know, you want to do your job at a high quality value. And then, you know, your perfectionism probably kicks in your OCD, maybe. I, I don't know. And we'll probably take off the D, just OC. Uh, and yeah. And then in that moment, that that point, there's a breaking point where, you know, it's just too much, but then you adapt and you overcome it and then you get the job done. How so? I have no idea how so. Uh, <laughs> I don't know the in-depth details of it, but I just know that we do, right? Yeah, that just took off lots of um, yeah trust in what it I don't know. Probably that's something you shouldn't say. I don't know. Anyway, well, you know, at least I'm honest. All right, so... Yeah, so yeah, the, the fact that you know that you're going to adapt eventually, especially if you're placed in a different environment or you get a different job, um, you know, that means there's actually you know, this, this hope, this glimmer, this idea that everything will eventually be okay if you're in a point in your time where it's not okay. So that's, that's one thing. That's one cool thing to think about, to talk about. So uh, along the lines of that, Right now, remember yesterday is critical thinking. So, yeah, we're implement. I just realized that we're implementing that every in. I'm implementing that in every single video that I make. So I have to actually think outside the box, inside the box, while you know making right judgments, and that's what that was about. And then we're gonna apply that to adapting. All right. So I I'm actually you know when you increase your skill in stuff. All right, so like say right now, I want to increase my on-camera presence, my camera skill, my presentation, how I'm here. All right, I am slowly adapting 
to a better version of myself than I was yesterday every single day or every single time I do this or every single time I initiate this exercise per se. And by doing so, you become a better version of you, which is probably the end goal that everyone wants to be or to have. You know, you want to be better than who you were yesterday than who you are today. At least 1%, 0.01%, at least there's a improvement because, you know, that improvement will compound over time. I don't know if I said that in a different video, but, you know, if you get 1% better each day, all right, the improvement will be compounded throughout a year and then there'll be like a like a 90% increase in stuff. All right, we'll probably go in depth on that in a different video, but I, I just saw a video and it made sense. So just trust me on that. <laughs> yeah. All right. So... That's that's the thing. So when you do something, you know, it has to be challenging, all right? Because if you do something that you know you can do, like for instance, this 30-day challenge, it's honestly at this point just it's not it's not challenging anymore. I can put out the content, but at the same time, I'm looking for those slow increases. So, if I watch yesterday's video, what can I do today that can be better than yesterday? All right? So that's what I'm thinking on a daily basis. But at the same time, you know, this right now I'm also doing habit for me. I want to form this habit of actually making a video when I have when I say I should make a video and that is daily. And you know, there there's a saying that it takes 21 days to make a habit. Now it's 60 days. All right, you know, just do 10,000 hours of a certain thing and you'll master it. That's that's probably the end goal that everyone wants to achieve. So, adapt Adapt and get better, adapt and get good, all right? Remember, like I said just a while ago, just a few minutes ago, that the fact that you, the fact that you know you can adapt should lessen the worry, should lessen the willpower needed to actually take risks, go out into the world, do your thing, pursue your passion, right? Remember, if you want to be a content creator, because, you know, this is probably one of the things that I want to focus on this channel is, you know, to help content creators, creative entrepreneurs make a living out of doing the things they're passionate about, the things that they love to do. Then remember that if you start, right, and then you, you're in a place where you're not sure you know what you're doing, all right, don't worry. That's normal, all right? And just know that you're going to adapt and get better. And get good at it you're gonna develop the skills you're gonna develop the knowledge then eventually you'll put those into application because you know what's knowledge without application right it's just knowledge right there's nothing happening so yeah just don't keep on consuming knowledge and apply it and then by doing that whole process you will adapt you will get better you will achieve the things that you want to achieve all right that was good right uh, yeah, see, th this is the thing with this hashtag project nine minute video that I found out, you know, it, it makes you think, well, it makes me think of stuff that I want to talk about, you know, that I find, do I do find passion about this because, you know, I was from a place where, uh, that, you know, I really would love someone telling me that. I have responsibility and then that, that I have choices that I can make that actually justify the changes that I go through in life and that that's some deep stuff. So yeah, we'll probably expound on that on a different video. And the fact that, you know, when you realize that you do adapt, there's you can take risk. There's nothing to worry about. So Hopefully you guys found value out of this video. Remember guys, don't worry, you'll adapt, you'll get better, you'll get there anyway. Until next time, see ya!